Morning, right, for another job. Trouble is, it's a school. And I don't know how we're going to be with the filming yet. There's a kids' club here, but I can't be filming kids. But anyway, quickly, there's a beautiful bit of architecture on this school. Uh, all these buttresses. Gothic arch. There you go along here. Buttresses again. Tumbled in chimney, that's been taken down though. The top bit. Same here again. Awful brick repairs. I can't even bother back, trying to match the same bricks, but it looks like they have actually used lime. But I don't know. There you go. Built in 1866. But the thing is, these jobs, this extension is built built on. We're doing one round the back. It's going to be the same as this. Uh, it ain't going to match up properly because that ain't what people do. Unfortunately, instead of trying to preserve the heritage of these jobs let's just go around the corner and we're here there's diamond um, it's sort of ready like most jobs but isn't um, four calls to go around here it's not been backfilled some of the floor ain't finished but we'll do that um, the original if you look carefully the joining you can see that was penny rolled um, we won't be doing that but, um, yeah, all the buttress there. Right, let's get sorted out here. Yeah. Right, I've cut out for the uh, damp, so we lap the damp in. Now, I know people are going to say that you should cut this cavity out, maintain the cavity all the way up there. In nearly 50 years of bricklaying, I've never done it in my life. Um, I've never been asked to do it, I've never been told to do it. Uh, I have asked building inspectors about it and they said don't do it because if you do that in that wall there you haven't got wall ties every three calls and you're going to destabilise the wall now I know especially up in the north of England I know people they do it up there but I'm not saying it's wrong I'm not saying it's right but um, I've never done it and I've never been told to do it and uh, that's it years ago I was just talking to Damon about it he said he's never done it either only many years ago when we used to tooth these walls out and then when you tooved it out, often you'd come out and it would just happen, you'd, you'd do the cavity, but um, we don't do that. That's a new one. I've never seen that detail on a arch, jack arch, flat cambered arch, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, it looks quite nice. Balls are out there. Oh yeah, you got it on the big arch, the big flat cambered arch up there as well. Nice. Look what we've had delivered. It's called a welfare unit. Welfare unit. What have we in here? Microwave, a sink, a table. Lovely, isn't it? Welfare unit. Got like this here. Look at that, posh toilet, drying room. Who makes these names up, welfare unit? It's a tea-up, isn't it? Hey, why are they trying to change the world? It's a tea-up. Uh, look at this, I bet they had some fun cutting uh, an old Staffordshire Blues, because these are proper ones, these are, with a hammer and bolster, to get that ramp. Oh, the buttress, not ramp, the buttress. Well, I've just found out, unbeknown to us, we've had to rake all this out. There's a conservation officer involved, and uh, apparently there's an email sent, but no one got it. Normal thing. And he wants it at uh, Westminster Smudge, the same as this. Uh, flush joint, silver sand, white cement, to do it lime, whatever. And he got that there. What's the point? <laughs> stupid, isn't it? <laughs> Absolutely stupid. And this is, I don't know. Like I said earlier, the original building, if you want to match anything, it's penny rolled, as I showed you. Uh, so we're not matching anything, really. Oh, well. All right, setting out English bond. Um, right. The stretch is going that way. The header's going that way. Header closure. No three quarters. You only do three quarters if you're instructed to. And if you're doing three quarters, it's all the way through the job. Not header closure here and a stretch of one side and that. It looks awful. 
Uh, and what you have to do, you have to break the bond sometimes. Um, right, so you've got in this period, for instance, stretcher either end, there and there, head of closure either end. But what they've done to do that, to get to obtain that, is put half in the middle. It's broken the bond, but it works. So that's, that's how you do it. it looks, everything looks symmetrical, looks the same. Um, and the same here. You know, a small three quarter. Doesn't matter, that's what you do. Stretch the either end, head of closure, head of closure. Uh, what that'll do here? Two headers. Two headers in there. Stretch the either end, head of closure, either end. That's the correct way to do it. Not um, three quarters here and three quarters there. Let's uh, get that penny rolled up there again, look. Old Victorian way of doing it. on this one, isn't it? Your side, girl, I want to be with you. I suppose you've been climbing that side up, that's my fault again, is it? Well, fucking hell, it's ending around here. <laughs> told me.
in this mark, isn't it? <laughs> Lovely tune, apart from the fact it's a Chelsea song. Oh yeah, uh, tighten up volume one, wasn't it? The album, 1970. Harry J and the All Stars. <laughs> Out of the dance floor, my old two tone suit on, Ben Sherman. Boy, could I dance as Air well. Air in the <laughs> 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 an hammer when the camera's off. <laughs> nice and dry here isn't it? Not a lot of water in the footings is there? No, we'll put a couple of gallons in the We'll put the hose in there tonight, shall we? Just to make us feel at home. YouTube ban or something for having that on there. Think about it. 
I would have thought he'd gone out of bait. Will he be out tonight, Chief? Funny country job, isn't it? Not Buckingham Palace, is it? Not Buckingham Palace. Bricks, are they? No good. Yeah, as soon as you lay them, they're there, aren't they? They're not moving. They could do with a bit of damping down, I suppose. But... <sighs> not a wise thing when it's frosted about, is it? Right. 
This is a situation where it's probably uh, quicker to build it by hand and put profiles up. Service. It only goes up 8, 2, 5, 11 course. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Another four more and it's done, isn't it? We're out of muck though. That week, uh, told you, you know, me and Tricky done a uh, scaffold pike. Three people died that week. Yeah. And there was 11 major rescues. <laughs> One of them was nearly me. <laughs> line on that are we tomorrow? Mm. Yeah, still gonna have to clamp a profile on it, just pull a line off or something. Well if you put our brick clamps on it. Oh I might go on there would I? Well I bet we could. Yeah? I bet we might be able to. We'll work way around it obviously but yeah. I'll nice. just clamp the baton up there. Yeah, and up there and just slide the line up. Yeah. Do something like that. It's only the first few course anyway isn't it? Eleven course and then Right up, yeah, but I'll get, a, I'll get a profile on the back of it then, yeah. do it as we go. <sighs> Got this nonsense here. The architect's come up with, oh, you ask me what that's about. I've been on a job where you raked it out rough because it's being pointy, weather pointy. Then the people said, Oh, I like it like that. Can you leave it like that? Yeah. Yes, I'm fine. Guys, isn't it? You think, Oh, I've done a much better job of that. There you go, the brickwork. Good traditional brickwork, that ain't it, Dave?
Vamos a hacer una...